さん、こんにちは。はい。Uh, today I want to share with you how we can keep our Japanese learning continuously even though we are staying at home. Yes. I want to share how I learn English. Yeah. To improve my English, I do one thing for last 25 years. That is this one. Yeah, do journaling. I write、uh, journaling every day in English, last 25 years. Yes, and what I like,、uh, I actually read Bible, pick up just one、uh, sentence, and write about my own feeling related to it. That's what I do. And you can do the similar thing. In Japanese, yes. Yeah, so I want to recommend you to write. Writing is very good, especially when you do it regularly. Why is it good? I want to share. The first thing you can express your own thoughts. Yeah, not just you understand the language, it's important to output. Especially in your own story and your own context. Yes. And also, when you write, you can increase your vocabulary. s Yeah. And number three, you can start at any level, whether you are a beginner or you are an advanced student. Yes. Yeah. The beginner, yes.、Uh, let's say you want to talk about my favorite Japanese food. What you can do, you can just write. 私の好きな食べ物は味噌ラーメンです。That's all you can like.It's fine. Yeah. And gradually you can like more difficult and more、uh, you can express more.、Mm. But if you are advanced student, you can like not only my favorite Japanese food is 味噌ラーメン。You can like how to make best 味噌ラーメン steps. Yeah. And number four, why we do journaling?、Uh, you can do it on your own, self learning every day. Yes. If not, you can do it in a group with your classmate or、uh, with a few of you. Yeah. You can do it. Yes. And number five, yeah. As you do journaling regularly,、uh, you will have more, more topics you can talk about. Let's say you have written、uh, my favorite Japanese food, and then when you meet Japanese friends, to start to talk about favorite food, it will come naturally. So you will prepare, you will be prepared to、uh, face such situation.、Uh, you, you meet up with Japanese friends, and meeting up with Japanese friends is no longer scary things. Oh, oh I'm very shy. But You will be very excited. Yeah. So that's the、uh, reason why we do journal. And then, how to journal? Journaling の仕方を紹介します。はい。It's okay to write a short sentence, but do it regularly.、Uh, every day is the best. If not, two or three times a week, or even once a week. Yeah, do it, but continue. And number two, yeah, write with your own words first. Yeah, students sometimes like to go to Google Translate immediately. But I can tell when you use Google Translate because the expression does not fit in the context or sounds not natural. So always try to think in a simple Japanese how to explain. And later you can check the dictionary. Okay, number three. After you write down your own journal,、uh, it's good to highlight those、uh, important and useful vocabulary for yourself. Yes. And number four, it's good to read aloud what you have written. And at first you can read it, after that you close it. And try to reproduce from your mind. That's how you can remember the phrases and prepare yourself 
when the situation to meet up with Japanese to come. Yes. And number five, it's good to look back what you have written in the past once in a while. Do you know why? When you look back, at that point of time, you didn't know how to write properly, but you can discover on your own. Eh? I should actually write in a better way. Yeah. And then you can also uh, know your progress. Okay, next one. What to write? じゃあ何を書きますか、えー、ジャーナリングといっても何を書くか Yeah. So you are wondering what to write? The simple thing, number one.、えー、the events in daily life. What did you, did you do? Or what's happening in your life? You can write. Yeah? Beginner student, you can just write. えー、今日私は美味しい味噌ラーメンを食べました。I ate a very good 味噌ラーメン。But if you are advanced student, you can write more detail. Yeah. And you can also write about people, about yourself, your family. I write about my husband, 主人のことをここに書いています。<笑> yeah. About your 友達 friends. Or any new encounters, or you can also write about your big boss. Yeah, and not just writing about the person. Let's share in your notebook your feeling and your thoughts. Yeah, don't worry, you don't have to show it to other people. But let's say you want to do in the group. Yeah, it will be good to、uh, decide one specific topic. Uh, for example, like every week, once a week. And then everybody l i k e about the same topic. Yeah, yeah, let's say this week, let's write about my favorite Japanese food. Suki na nihon ryori. Then everyone l i k e Then you can exchange. In this way, you can actually learn from each other. And if you spot any mistake、uh, of others' writing, You can、uh, teach each other. So you can have a learning community together. That's what I would like to see. This one, you can do it among students, or if, if you need,、uh, I can also check your、uh, writing. Just like this example I show, this is one of our writing by a student. And I did check, and after I check,、uh, the student can practice the part. She made a mistake. That's how we improve one step by one step. Yeah, so、uh, let's not stop your learning and let's keep the rhythm、uh, daily or weekly. Yeah, you can do it at your own pace, but most importantly, don't stop it. Yes, yeah, let's keep going. <laughs>